Rivers protests at the gate of Federal High Court Abuja following the postponement of the trial of Mazin Nandekalu to October. Sunday, Ibo's trial in Kotonu begins with his wife and the only delegate present. Baba Ijesha trial at John T tomorrow as the opening statement begins. Soworo, Soworo arrested and also released. Hello people, welcome back again to my space. My name is Sizu J and you're welcome to Sizu J TV. If you are new here, you are welcome. Please feel free to become part of this great family by smashing the red button and also turning the bell notification beside so that whenever I upload any new video, you will be among the first to get its notification. My returning friends, thank you guys for always coming back. Yes, so this particular video is fully packed. Yes, fully packed. So we'll go to the first one, which is um, the adjournment of uh, Mazin Namdekalo's trial to October 2021. Officials of the Department of State Service, DSS, has failed to produce the leader of the proscribed indigenous peoples of people of Biafra, Ipo, Mazin Namdekalo, at the Federal High Court today in Abuja, being Monday 26, 2021. Mazin Namdekalo, um, has been facing some charges. He was um, scheduled to appear today before Justice Binta Yako for the continuation of his trial. However, the prosecuting lawyer, Mohamed Abubakar, told the court that Mazin Nadukalo was not in court today due to logistic reasons, according to the nation's report. In response, the judge declared that the case cannot proceed or could not go on because of the absence of um, the indigenous people of Biafra leader Mazin Namdukalo. On his part, Mazin Namdukalo's lawyer, Ifai Ejofo, told the court that the life of his client was in danger. So um, the, the lawyer went ahead to explain that he has been unable to have access to his client for the past 10 days. Following his submission, the presiding judge made an order directing the DSS to grant Kano access to his lawyers. She then adjourned the case till October 21st, but said the date could be brought back if the prosecution was able to obtain a fiat from the court's judge to allow proceedings during the ongoing vacation of the courts. Meanwhile, members of the IPO, members of IPO, most of them have been arrested and some were chased out of the premises as they stormed the Federal High Court in Abuja to um, observe the trial of their leader. The IPO members, they stormed in court large numbers to uh, monitor the proceeding of Nandikalo's trial that is meant to hold today. But um, security agents were left with no option other than to send them away and some were arrested as well. Like the video um, that you saw earlier, which I'll be dropping again for you people to see. So following this adjournment, um, a lot of, most of the IPO members had seen at the entrance of the court in Abuja, National Court in Abuja, protesting, okay, because of this. And most have been reacting following this adjournment of the trial. Um, especially they are asking if for the well-being of their leader, if he is okay. So, um, a journalist turned activist, Omoyele Soworo, had a brush or clash with the security agencies today at the Federal High Court. Soworo faulted the security agencies for preventing him from observing the trial of the IPOB leader, Namdikalo. According to the report, he was arrested and shortly after the arrest, Soworo um, confirmed through his Facebook page in a video that he has been um, released by the police. He claimed that he was dragged and harassed by the police and uh, has been released after the police ascertained that he was at the court for another case relating to some um, detained activists that was arrested at Dunamis Church, Abuja. Soro, who was in a vehicle at the time he was recording that particular video, said that the police has no reason to arrest him because he has the right to observe the trial of Mazi Namdakano, that it is his fundamental human rights.
Also, um, Sunday Buho's wife, as well as some delegates that were sent by the old Oni of Ife, they are in Benin Republic for the trial of Sunday Buho. You guys can recall that Sunday Buho was arrested a few days ago at the airport in Kotonou, Benin Republic, while he was trying to leave the country for Germany. As of the moment, we heard that um, he has been released from the cops and uh, has been granted access to see his wife and also given access. Um, um, doctors have been given access to also see him. So um, I'll be bringing you guys more updates as the case unfold. Also, um, Baba Ijesha. For those who are not conversant with Baba Ijesha case, please check through my channel. You see videos that will uh, bring you up to date of Baba Ijesha case. Yes, Baba Ijesha trial has asked, has also commenced today. He was in court today. Yabodja as well as Princess, they were also in court today. I'll be showing you guys video clips from there and also video clips from the um, Nandi Carlos trial in Abuja today. So the Baba Ijesha case has commenced. The hearing has commenced. Tomorrow it will continue. So guys, this is it. So I said, let me get, bring you guys updates on these happenings. Um, thank you guys and please do not forget to leave a comment, like and also share and see you guys in my next video. I'll be dropping some clips so that you guys will see. Thank you. I don't need this. Hey, madam. I don't need it here. No. no Did you hear me? Yes, sir. I don't need it here no right yes, now. No problem. Just pass. Go on. Oh, keep calm. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Yeah. Why? Go in peace. We don't want this garden. Please go in peace. Go where? Sir, sir, Oh, you don't want to go? I want to know where we are going. Okay, leave this place. Shoot him now! Shoot him! Shoot him! Hey! 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 This is actress Ia Bojo at the court today for Baba Ijesha case. Thank you.